A few weeks ago, Justin Timberlake was photographed with his co-star, apparently during a lapse of judgment. He blames being too drunk and making bad choices. My question is, why make this apology? If he is in fact innocent and nothing happened between him and his co-star, then why should his behavior be deemed inappropriate? I'm sure that his publicist probably put him up to it. Or maybe he is actually guilty and there was something going on between him and his co-star. Jessica Biel doesn't strike me as an insecure or insanely jealous person. I mean, she is married to Justin Timberlake after all and stands beside him and completely holds her own. So this apology isn't for her. This public apology is for us. Why isn't it okay for him to have consensual, non-sexual touch with his friend? In other cultures, people kiss each other to welcome them hello and say goodbye. But in our culture, any type of intimate touch must mean that we're having sex with someone. What should imply that we're having sex with someone is when we are actually having sex with someone. Touching someone when you talk to them or holding their hand or hugging them or kissing them or cuddling with them doesn't mean you're in a sexual relationship with someone. And we shouldn't be discouraging these types of behaviors. What we should be doing is clearly outlining how we want to interact with people in our lives, be they friends, lovers, coworkers. We should be able to establish types of touch in our relationships and set boundaries and maintain relationships with integrity. My problem with Justin Timberlake's apology is that it perpetuates Me Too culture. We continue the mindset of ownership over one another. When we are in a relationship, we co-create that situation with each other and we should be educating people on how to set boundaries. There's a whole generation of people that are becoming adults that are gonna need to learn how to navigate these situations and relationships. And we should be encouraging them to discuss agreements. We only belong to ourselves and we are responsible for our own actions. As humans, touch is vital to our health and happiness. We need to destigmatize consensual non-sexual touch. It's okay to touch our friends. It's okay to hug or kiss or cuddle with our friends. And no, that doesn't imply that we're in a sexual relationship with them. But the problem with the apology and all of the others like it is that it doesn't point us in the right direction. We can learn to have more integrity in our relationships. We can learn to be more clear about our intentions. We can't keep stopping our loved ones from being friends with their exes on Facebook because we're insecure and fearful. We have to instill a sense of honesty and integrity in our relationships. While I think that it's admirable that he apologized publicly for the sake of his wife and child, I think a person of his position could do so much more that will impact generations to come.